this is an extension for the video lectures related to the length converter uh, plus uh, functions. So we already discussed how to uh, create that particular application where I can convert from meters, yard, miles into the meter, yard, miles uh, by using the button convert and clear. So now what is the target? The second target here is to use the functions uh, very similar to what uh, we implement uh, for our first uh, application, uh, temperature converter. So now we do have a length converter, slightly more complex uh, than the temperature converter. So that's why the way of handling uh, functions will be a little bit more complex. So now let's discuss how to modify the source code. This is our length converter. Uh, and finally, uh, create something similar to what we have uh, here. Uh, okay, so see, this is our application. So here, one by one, we will process quite complex calculations. So here, it depends uh, what exact uh, convertation we will process. So this particular equation here, uh, I want to unify them together. So, and make that equation based on the way how to create the correct uh, converted length based on the situation we have. Uh, okay, so the first of all, let's try to make our function. Okay, so here uh, I supposed to convert from uh, meters uh, to yard. Okay, so now, uh, what kind of function uh, we supposed to have? So I will come back to our calculator. Okay, so this is our function from the calculator. So and let's try to update it uh, here. Okay, so what we want to do is to convert, like get the converted temperature. So here will be the function. Let's call it length, length converter. Length converter. Okay, so now, uh, like length function, I think, let's delete function. I just want to use length converter. So that particular length converter should be the universal and based on the the data, what we will use as the input data, that's supposed to process our calculation, okay? So the input parameter for sure should be the initial length. But our length converter also should know what kind of convertation it must uh, process. Okay, so that's why here I will add uh, two more. So two, two, two more parameters. Uh, okay, so that will be meters and yards. 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 Okay, see, what is the point of this particular function? So here, by just placing the necessary meters, yards into the initial code, I will process my necessary calculation, so this calculation. So, and uh, now compared to the previous case, so my function uh, has one output parameter and three input parameter. So this is the, the first parameter will be uh, from what I want to convert. The second parameter will be to what I want to convert and will be the initial length, which is the number. Okay, so now let's make uh, that particular uh, function. So, copy this. Okay. So, our function will have a type float.
So the name of function is the length converter. Okay, so this uh, meters, uh, this is text, so that's why it's supposed to be a string. Uh, let's let's call it from. Yeah, from. So the second one, this is also string, the text. Two. Okay, and initial length supposed to be what? Okay, so the semicolon we don't need. Open, close. Uh, okay, so here close output. Then uh, let's make it zero and return output length. Okay, and now our function start uh, start be correct, but again inside there is no any calculation. Okay, so now. Uh, so now I will need to repeat. So what kind of calculation I am going to do here? So if so, the correct procedure will be uh, so here I supposed to compare my from. So where is the uh, command that's called matches? This one. Okay, so and here I supposed to match the from with uh, what? Let's say uh, meters. Okay, so if my from equal meters, okay, and two matches uh, yards, yards. So I am I supposed to process the calculation. Okay, so now coming back uh, to the beginning, actually here we can see it is slightly wrong because here the brackets must be different. Okay, so yards, meters, yards, okay, and that particular equation. So I will move here. Okay, uh, output length. Output length. Okay, so now let's check. Uh, okay, so let's convert 100 meters to yards. Okay, done. So it means that this part is working because see here meter yards, so there is no calculation. So it means that my converted length came from the function uh, length converter. So then finally, that will be our answer. Uh, okay, so I'm using the similar way. Let's modify. Like modify our code everywhere where I supposed to call. So that function. So the meter to miles. So meter to yard, meter to miles. Okay, so here, yeah, and I don't need. So and uh, this part, I supposed to add into my function. So here I can actually add. meter miles and calculation must be changed like this. Okay, and I will need to process it for the all other uh, cases. So here will be yards, meters,
So yard meters, yard miles. So here will be miles uh, meters and miles yards. And here I supposed to add the necessary convertation. So the yard meters. So yard meters. This one. Yard. Yard meters. Yard miles. Miles. So now miles and meters. So this is my miles, meters, so this Miles, meters, and miles, yard. Meters, this is from miles to yards. Okay, this part is done. So uh, now I need to change everywhere uh, with my function. Okay, so here, see yards to meters. Instead of this, so here I will just write yards meters. So such kind of way is more convenient because uh, I can directly control here yeah, will be yards to miles. So here is miles to meters. And the last one is the miles to yards. Yards. Okay, so and that's all. Okay, so now let's check. Okay, so let's say one meter to yard. Okay, correct. One meter to mile. Okay, so one yard to meter, correct, one yard miles, correct, uh, okay, so something wrong with the miles, yard to miles. Uh, okay, so here what we can do, just clamp converter. So how many yards in the mile? Okay, so this number I supposed to write uh, here. Yeah, this is mistake. Yeah, two miles. Okay, meters, two miles, yard, two miles, yeah, okay. So that's supposed to be something like this. Okay, run. Okay, so one yard, how many meters? Okay, so here, one yard, how many miles? Yeah, okay, this number. Uh, makes sense. Okay, so in the last one, let's say how many meters. Okay, looks correct. And how many 
yards. And so on six. Yeah, okay. This is correct. So now what we did. So we create one single function, length converter, so which uh, is based on the three input parameters. So those three input parameters, this is the string text uh, from, uh, string text uh, to, and initial length. So right here in that particular function, based on what is the string from and what is the string to, so we will process the different calculation. So, and inside of our main source code, now if I want to get the necessary length, so instead of uh, using the equation, so here we are using the uh, quite, we are using the command line, uh, which is quite easy to understand. So if I want to get the length, my length converter, uh, is working with the two input parameters. First parameter is uh, from, second parameter is to. Okay, and third parameter is our length, what I want to convert. And just by changing that particular uh, parameter uh, from and parameter to, so we can finally process and calculate uh, our converted length. So finally, that will be. Uh, our answer. Uh, okay, I think that's all for the extension of the lecture related to the length converter functions. Uh, good luck.